Good afternoon, Vikes. Today we're going to learn more about the One Act Play. I'm Madison. And I'm Kara. And this is your daily news. Seniors, we have three panoramic group pictures left. Stop by Mrs. Varner's desk if you would like to purchase one. Auditions for the spring one act plays are tomorrow. Let's go learn more about it. I'll do it. Hello Vikes, I'm here with Mrs. Payne to talk about the one act plays. So, what are the one act plays? There are three one act plays, which is a play that is um, kind of shortened down in time. So we're gonna be doing three of those. They are, let me check. There's a comedy called Small Actors that Reagan Props is directing. There's a comedy called Check, Please that Madison Flory is directing. And there's a courtroom drama called The Charges Murder that Lucas Anderson is directing. This is the first time that we have had three student directors direct three one-act plays. Well, that's really cool. When is rehearsal? Rehearsals are after school, and we'll work around those who are in the musical. But uh, And it's going to be, uh, you cannot miss any rehearsals for this because the rehearsal schedule is shortened because the plays are in April, mid-April. They are the 19th, 20th, and 21st, and they're going to be great. Okay, what are the requirements to do this? You need to pick up an audition form from myself or from Madison Flory. Auditions are tomorrow at 3.15 in the choir room, and that's different from what we normally do. So make sure you fill that out and come and read. You can be in more than one play, uh, but you can't have two leads. You could have a large part and a small part. But come audition. All right. Now back to your anchors. Thank you. If you have not done so, please pick up an audition form from Diva and W18. Key Club members, reminder that you have a meeting tomorrow morning at 725 in room E30. The last Washburn Tech entrance testing that will be giving at the school this year has been rescheduled for Friday. There are a few slots left. See Mr. Alexander today if interested. The Model UN participated at Wichita State last Friday. Congrats to these delegates for getting honorable mention. The ACT prep classes will begin in the school library. The registration deadline is February 9th and the cost is $40. Get an application in C2 or the counselor's office to be a participant for financial scholarships. Friday is the last day to submit your SPI-8 from Washburn application to your counselor. Now, over to, now on over to Madison with the sports. Don't vape, because you will get lung cancer and you will die. Don't vape in the classroom. Don't vape in the bathroom. Don't vape in the parking lot. Just don't vape, promise. Vaping may seem harmless, but it can lead many lasting effects, such as breathing problems, bloody sores, weakened immune system, and insomnia. Majority of teens don't know that most vape contains nicotine, which can lead to a potential drug addiction. Okay, everybody take some candy. No. <laughs> Russells prevailed over four teams of their dual tournament over the weekend. The swim, te swim team won the Blue Valley Southwest Invitational. They won five of the 11 events. The boys varsity basketball took second at the January Jam. Trey Duffy was named MVP and was chosen first all tournament. Now let's go to Kara over with the weather. What's going on, Vikes? It is currently 35 degrees, and tonight will stay about the same with chances of snow and rain. 
For your three-day forecast, you have highs in the 40s and 50s and lows in the 20s, 30s, and 40s, and it'll get clearer as the week goes on. Today in history, it is Logic's birthday and it's National Blonde Brownie Day. Now back to your anchors. Make sure to come out and see the one act play and show your theater talent. Have a great rest of your day.